My name is Trina and I work for the Métis Nation of Alberta. Today, my friends and I are going to show you how to play the fur traders game. But before we start, I want to share some information about the fur trade. Did you know the Métis were called the children of the fur trade? It's true. A long time ago, the fur trade connected the First Nations and the European people, creating the first Métis families. Métis fur traders and their families worked hard and were proud of the work and how it built community. They shared. Everyone also took great joy in their way of life. They sang songs, played instruments, and enjoyed being with their communities. They had fun while building community. Before we begin, make sure all the pieces are cut out and the beaver pelts are hidden. All right, let's play. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go, well, and probably Darcy and Peter, the adults, we're gonna go hide them. So what I'm gonna get you guys to do is probably just sit on the ground over here and cover your eyes. Grab your fur trader's logbook. Are you guys ready to play the fur trader game? Yeah! yeah! All right, three, two, one, go hunting! Go find the hidden beaver pelt. I got the Bring your pelts to the trading post. Trade your pelts for a fiddle, buttons, beads, snowshoes, or a trapper's tent. Record the trade by checking it off on your logbook. Collect enough pelts to complete your logbook. I want the beads, but I don't have enough. I have some to share. If you have found more beaver pelts than you need, share with other traders in need. Let us know how much you enjoy playing this game by using hashtag MA Early Years on social media. See you next time!